Hey guys, and welcome back to Daily Duel. So today is Thursday. It means we are using Tendrum Chaos Dragon. So yeah, also tagging with Tiago. So if I'm a little bit tight, uh, uh, quiet, then I apologize. It's, it's, uh, it's 4 o'clock in the afternoon. In the morning, well, four o'clock in the afternoon, no, four o'clock in the morning. I can't even get that right. Yeah, it's four o'clock in the morning, and I am pretty tired. Pretty tired, I must say. So, we decided that, you know, generally I would record a day ahead, but of course, uh, you know, I have to generally get up early to record because, you know, me and Tiago had different time zones. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, we're just gonna start off the next time. I'm gonna say it's probably some of them are probably his trap trap searcher card, but yeah, that's still. Okay. I'm not surprised you actually let him get up to that point to the turn to tribute, but yeah, I don't know. So wait, what does that card do? One, two, one. Oh, that's the new Nordic card from the uh, D's world. That's cool. Okay. Well, it sucks that I drew two freaking Equip Swipers, definitely that sucks. Not a big fan of drawing that. Uh, we'll send you. Yes, we will. Send you. Build the law. I'll go ahead and give you. You're a little bit more important than uh, Redim. I'll go ahead and mill some, even though I don't, generally I don't want to. Uh... Uh, I'm not Illumina. That sucks. Right in. I don't mind taking the dual slot right now. What else do I know? Don't want to mill you, don't want to build you, don't want to mill you. Alright, mill shit, I don't want to mill. <laughs> right, can I get a Dragon Ruler? Or more shit, I don't want to mill. No, I'm, I'm, at least I'm not a Dragon Ruler. That's cool. So, uh, yeah. I, the thing is that, of course, if we record on Wednesday, you know, early Wednesday mornings, then of course I have not experienced my Wednesday, therefore I have nothing to talk about, which would put me a day behind when it comes to talking. But then on, uh, artifacts. Okay. Fun. Fun for everyone. I hate the artifact engine, I swear to god I do. Get real sick and tired of it. Oh. Uh, I'm real fucking sick and tired of the artifact engine. What? The reason why I'm doing that. So I can go ahead and get uh, Spot Eyes to go ahead and use its effect right now. Yeah, that seems fun. Hate this. I hate. I also hate the fact that everybody gets sent them besides me. I never when I when I had that shit in my deck. I never got it. I would always draw them for all times. Always. Never get the sent <laughs> Fucking ridiculous. Uh, uh, oh, artifact shadows. Well, didn't he say no shadows in the fucking thing? I really, I love it. it when it, you guys on this, whenever Tiago hosts, it always he always puts the message no shadows. Yeah, he don't give a fuck. He did say no shit else. Like I said, they don't give a shit. They don't give a shit. There's no respect. All the disrespect. All of it. Anyway, so 
instead of you know waking up early Wednesday morning to record, therefore I would have not no Wednesday experience. Got to wake up early Thursday morning to go ahead and talk about my Wednesday, and then I have my video, of course. But uh, the problem with that is that uh, yes, I may not have class till 9:30, but of course on Tuesdays and Thursdays I go donate. Uh, so since I go donate. Uh, Okay. Oh, we came back from the, the thing. I was gonna say, they use that thing as a single material and it comes back right now. It was the, the spear thing that got it extra time. That's right. <sighs> So yes, I go donate, in which I leave out of the house to go donate at like 5.20. So, of course, gotta get up a little bit earlier than I would generally get up. So I get up, uh, record, then, then go. Wow, wow, they quit? Really? They quit? Ah, alright, we're gonna have to get another duel in. They're back. Alright, we're back. So. Uh, yeah, so pretty much I gotta wake up earlier than I would usually have to wake up early on Thursday just so we can record and have this uh, recorded, edited, rendered, and uploaded because there's really no time for me to do anything by the time I literally, I leave out of class 20, but I don't get back uh, sometimes until like 9 o'clock. Class is at 9.30, gotta, you know, turn around, hop back in the car, and head off to class. So sometimes there is just not enough time for me to, um, uh, do that stuff so and of course like last thursday we were cutting it close and we did uh last thursday of course with tag tago after the one duel tag had to go because literally i was like okay i'll just do it when i get home from college but i get home from college so late that you know our time difference pretty much tago has to uh get off the computer so yeah uh, this is a little bit inconvenient to me because i wake up a little bit early than i uh usually would want to uh kind of tired, much more monotone, not as enthusiastic as I would usually be, but uh, this is what we're going to have to do, so I apologize for the inconvenience to everybody, and if I sound too monotone for you, uh, just know that it should be just for just for Thursday videos, because so, I am, I'm, I'm, I, it, it was like literally, it was just like, wake up, get up, oh, he's playing, uh, I mean, yokai. Okay, so he can summon, what, sixes? Or is this, is this the one that can go to 11? That's the one that can go to 11. So you get the, oh, well you also draw multiple of him. You got it off. Whenever I try that play, I just get clogged up with him, and yeah, not the best of plays. Sorry. Of course, so he's gonna inflict damage to us. And then this guy's gonna be like, "Hey, you did damage. Get the tr get your solemn judgment." Like. Oh my god, it's so stupid. So stupid. What? You're not gonna get the solemn judgment? I guess you're like, eh, I don't need it right now. I'll deal with that later. So, uh, does he not return back to the hand or does he? I can't remember. Wow, okay. So he main decks the fucking DD Crow and just throws it at fucking Tiago for no fucking reason. That's stupid. That was real stupid. That was fucked up. Cause he actually needs that in the graveyard like that and you're just gonna fuck him up like that. That is a serious inconvenience. I'm gonna run something like a 101 out of Castell, right? 
Oh wait, I could just sugar something. Ah, oh, but it would go back to the extra deck. So no, I have to handle this with Castell. Yeah. Definitely will leave with Castell. What did I mill? Two cards that I don't want to mill. Alright, that's good. Alright. Yeah, I need to handle this with Castell. So and we know exactly what he has in hand, he has those two Hermit Yokai monsters. I said if he didn't pen to summon that fucking uh, 3000 beater, he, just, he wouldn't have had a, even a way to get over the Felgrand, so. Yeah. A magical mallet, though. Was this Evil Swarm? Really? Yeah. No, it's Spirits? No, it's Spirits. He just ran into Mandrigo as, as a helper. As a little footstool. It's the same idea as. They'd be gunning on the Magibora. So what you gonna do make a 101 and take me? Go ahead. <sighs> anyway, already like 11 minutes into this video and I haven't even talked about Wednesday, which is the whole point why we are doing it like this, so we can talk about my Wednesday, of course, yep. So, uh, I know there is not much Tiago can do right now, especially with his, uh, his second card vanished because that was that was just that, that was just a dick move. He was just like drunk. He was just like, oh hey, yeah, and DD Craft like, and where the fuck did that come from? But apparently this guy is such a douche to main deck DD Crow. Main deck it. That's not side main deck it. Like hello. Yeah, but you do what you gotta do, right? This still's gonna get annoying. Oh, vanities too. All right. Well, we we'll probably lose. Without resource, we're locked down. There's not much we can do. Not at all. So that 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 card is like the embodiment of evil. I swear. Uh, but Konami wanted to make the money off of it. It should have been hit. They, no, just Konami wanted to make money off of it, so. I understand. At this point, we pretty much lose, because he's just going to attack over this. Attack, we take that, get the Solemn Judgment card. So even if I get the MST, they can, of course, negate it with Solemn Judgment, with the Solemn Judgment card. So. It's not looking good for us right now. Yeah. Ooh. Oh wait, he can't, well the Solemn Judgment card won't work because uh, the only monsters that he control aren't Hermit Yokai because he has this 101, so that's okay I guess, but seriously, that Vanities, that Vanities though, I need to figure out a way to deal with that Vanities, but it's going to be a very difficult time, like Hermit Yokai's plus Vanities, like that's fucked up, because we, we clearly can't go over a 21 beater without special summoning. That, it's a very difficult task. So, to have to deal with that is just really inconvenient. I don't think it's possible for us to get over a 21 beater. We'd have to pretty much just wait, wait for a world decree, but no one, neither of us are getting it, so. <sighs> if only I could special summon. Oh well. What you gonna do? Vanities ones again. What are you gonna do, right?
That's how you feel sometimes. Yep. Alright, we'll get one more door in. Be right back. Oh my god. Uh, I get up to record with Kyo. And both Holly and Stan are like, Hey, you wanna record? Like, you know what, you two? I don't like you two. <laughs> Fucking. Alright, he's just gonna search for the bottomless and set just the bottomless. Okay. Okay. He's just like, I'm gonna get him. I'm gonna get him. <laughs> just the bottomless. <sighs> anyway, let me start talking about my freaking uh, freaking Wednesday, because that's what you guys came in for. Because so of course Wednesdays I have my education class, and I have oh, are you just gonna you're not gonna take the bottomless on the train? You're just gonna leave it for me? Is that how it is? We are not getting Royal Decree. Have you noticed that? This all all three duels. We have not gotten Royal Decree at all. Like hello, like can can one of us get Royal Decree? I love Royal Decree, especially now, especially with all the fucking back row in Yu-Gi-Oh. I would love some Royal Decree up in here. Anyway, education class and women's literature. So, uh, education class. Uh, I was walking to the class and then I saw one of my classmates. Uh, seriously. Seriously, I have no idea where fucking Rana Decree is. I would love to have it right now. I can actually find I can finally use poly, but what does it say? I'm unaffected if I use a pendulum monster, right? Then I turn this card through summon using a pendulum summon yeah, pendulum summon monster monsters. So you know, I'll take the phone's card back. Okay, well I'm not, so uh I can go for it, but there would really be no point, so You know, you're a spellcaster, so if I go with you, I can at least attack, what, three times? Or is it... No, two times, two times. Ah. Yeah, I guess I'll just go ahead and... That's with you. Like I said, they got fucking all the background in the world, so I'm probably gonna get fucked up, but... There ain't shit I can do. There is no royal decree in sight. Yep. Two, three, four, five. Well, of course, the Royal Decree. Everything else can get us scared from. I give a shit, but of course, that Royal Decree. But God, look at that back row go. Ugh! You want to throw up in your mouth? This back row. <laughs> Embodiment of Yu-Gi-Oh! That is Yu-Gi-Oh! Back row. The other card in the game has cards like that. <sighs> Enough trap cards in Yu-Gi-Oh! to fucking lock it down. Lock it down, Mickey, so you can't put your shoes to be a dead floor, just trap card, only trap. All you do is just one up your opponent. I do a deck like that for, uh, for, uh, April Fools. In 2015, just make a deck full of traps and background, just back the shit out of my opponent. Just back the shit out of Then they know how I feel. Then they will know how I feel. It's got, so, you know. We could commit to a play, but since we'll commit to a play, we're gonna go ahead and get hit by. by we at least know one of those is a bottomless. We at least know one of those is a bottomless. So bottomless, not including the other three back of that, of course. The Battling Boxer player said it, and what means that if the Battling Boxer player said it, then it probably means that it's the protected Hermit Yokai. But, I mean, it's Hermit Yokai, his yoke, the, 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 the Y caught me off guard, you know? So, so, there's probably a lot more stuff, so. 
And the sales manager looks for Curry Ben and he's like, I got the Royal Decree, but of course it's not tell the enemy page, so. Bottomless. Better bottomless him now. Because if you don't, he's gonna make a fell burn, so you gotta bottomless now. Void. Okay, well, something like that. That's said, There's no point in even fucking doing this. There's no point in fucking committing the plague until I get that Royal Decree up. But by the time I get that Royal Decree up, it might be over. So. Snuggles. No, oh, yeah, Soul Charge. Okay, cool. I guess he's just trying to bait out the shit out of that back row. Are you gonna pay 2007 Galaxy Wizard and, uh, and Galaxy Eyes? Seems like a smart idea to me that way, you know, they, they're of course gonna bottomless him. Yep. Oh, yeah, you want right? Damn, you want everybody. Take him then. It's a lot of life points, so I hope that this play works out. I don't like points. Bottomless. So bottomless, we get what? Threes, three? What's the point of summoning these guys? You're just gonna get bottomless. You should have just summoned him. Nah, we're we'll probably gonna lose this. Bottomless, one, two, three. And you still got him. Like, you, sh you shouldn't even revive these two. There's no point in summoning these two. It should have just been him and him. That way, when he plays bottomless on him, that way we'd still have him. So. Why did he not bottomless? That was dumb. That was dumb. He, he let him get away with that. That was dumb as hell. I want to do bottomless to Felgram. Anyway, uh, I walked a different way throughout the class, and I saw one of my classmates, so I decided to walk the same route that she was walking. So uh, we were walking up the steps. It's on the third floor, so. Lots of flights of steps. Lots. It's a nice workout. Anyway, uh, while we're, while we're walking some steps, she starts talking to me. She's like, hey, did you do uh, this assignment too today? I'm like, what assignment? It's like, oh, you know, your your uh, reflective letter. I'm like, oh? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. So, uh, yeah, she's like, oh, it's not that hard. She's like, I didn't do it. I didn't even know it was due. So, uh, didn't get that done, which kind of sucks, but... Not completely. Oh, of course, I'll try to can attack. This is the battling box you guy. Yeah. So Tiago took that some most of that back row to the chin, which sucks. More back row. All right. All right. Well, I'm clearly going to be setting this uh, Royal Decree definitely. I'm gonna set this Royal Decree, definitely. I like that song. It's, it's, it's Royal Decree, definitely. Royal Decree, definitely, definitely, definitely. Oh, I know what I wanna do. I know what I want to do. I'm gonna summon you, pitch you, get you, make a Black Rose, Black Rose, wipe the field, fell ground, block yourself. Seems chill to me. And see, of course, I have the back row to stop me. Who do I want to send? I need you and I need you. You, on the other hand. You could be summoned after he dies, right? Yeah. Yeah, that seems like a chill idea. Do I want to... Yeah, I do. I would like to do that. No. Well, I'm the dragon ruler. Also, I wrote a crate, but that's cool. Alright. You. Okay. I mean, you better have something to stop this summon. What trap hold bombers or whatever won't stuck and stop that black horn. Alright. That's an inconvenience, but it's fine. It's inconvenience at the most, so that's fine. I tried. 
I tried. Miss T. Yep. Uh, uh. That's all they have is back row. They weren't back row and shit unless we could probably play, but we can't even fucking play Yu-Gi-Oh right now because of the fucking back row. You wanna get the fucking row decree? You wanna try to black row them? No, 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 no. Back row, back row, back row, back row. Like, please. Please, can I please play Yu-Gi-Oh! I don't fucking ask for much. I just wanna play Yu-Gi-Oh! It's not that fucking hard. I just want to play Yu-Gi-Oh! His effect is it once per turn? I don't know, I don't see giant hand a lot because no one fucking has it, but... <sighs> Alright, I'm tired. I'm tired of this. Tired of all the background. Tired of fucking trying. It's fucking annoying. Can't believe the effect is it once per turn. He's like, oh, he touched two materials and it's just fine. And oh, he touched a multi-chain and, you know, it doesn't matter. Can't wait for Tiago to flip up that roll to crate. It's gonna make me so fucking happy. Actually, I still can't play. Still can't fucking play because I can't pencil him so much shit. I hate fucking that I can't put fucking what's his name in the zone if there's monsters on the field. It really does suck. Eh, I'll at least be able to do something. When I wrote a Kree, I'll kill him and him. So what? You're planning on ramming into Odd Eye, I mean, Fogren or something? What you gonna do, lance him? Or do you want to just detach to get stronger? I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, uh, so we get the class, the assignment. He decides to push it back by like three weeks, which is just ridiculous, but yeah, he does. Oh my god. I wonder what his intent on that was. I have no idea. Is it really worth using an honest whore? I don't know. I don't think so. Uh, is that even an attachment of that, or was it like if your opponent eats your monster with a detach or something? Cause that wasn't even an attachment. I don't feel like reading all that though. It's an ass ton of effect. Like a 101 in take us? Right? Alright, I'll relay these two, make something. Take the Felgram. Yep. It's cool, we don't get to play Yu-Gi-Oh. Lord. <laughs> oh my god. I have seriously not sent. I don't know. Because they're bad. 
Because they're bad and they're relying on backward to fucking handle this duel, but clearly it's not gonna work. Well, I can go for uh, Michael. Really wish I still had Black Rose right now, but I only run one. Because I don't think that I need to do Black Rose that much. Oh, I can summon. It's still, I can summon a Dragon Rose as well. I got Tempest? Yeah. Yeah, I can summon Tempest. So, okay, summon Michael, summon Tempest, banish you, attack over you, attack over you. Make like a big eye or something. Take you. Yeah, I could do all that. Oh, no. Oh, I got place. Just trying to think in the order and what I want to do this. Two. Bring back you. Get your effect. Then we two, hopefully, an Eclipse Wyvern, please? No. Probably in a fucking Charger Light Brigade. I don't have much of Charger Light Brigade anyway. So. But of course, go ahead and go into Mikhail. Let's so say you got Book of Moon. Alright. We'll go ahead and some new. By getting the EU and U. Alright, so. Of course, I'm gonna activate my effect. Ouch. Give it to you. Definitely. Get the fuck out of my face. <sighs> Alrighty then. Get you. Say what, you got some play to activate or something? What the fuck does this guy do? Why does he keep coming back? Oh. That's fucking annoying. It's fucking annoying as hell. So every time he takes fucking damage and all his cards in the graveyard just pops right back like hi. Like nigga. It's fucking annoying. Uh I, mean, I could make a big eye, but what's the point? I can make a Draco sack. That might be the safest play. I don't know how many cards my opponent has in his hand. I really don't. It's a safer play. Six cards in his hand? Oh my god, wow, we're still gonna lose then. Did not know that. I thought he was down on resources. Note him. Because that's totally fair, yep. This, this whole duel is just cheap and disgusting. I did not know he still had six cards in his hand. I thought we were remotely close to ending this duel. I did not know that. Oh well. Uh, anyway, let me let me finish talking tell, talking about my day and ending this video, of course. Much more lively than I was at the beginning of this video, since I'm more awake, of course. Uh, anyway, uh, so class. Uh, what did we even talk about in class? I don't know. No, we were behind, so uh, I don't remember. I remember. I don't remember. 
that's just just usual class anyway. Uh, of course, as you guys know, I uh, talked to um, Amish girl in that class. And Amish girl, uh, one of the people who I would say is probably more than at this point probably more than a friend. You know, definitely. And she interacts with me. And she's happy to see me. You know, we're we're we're, more, we're 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 friends. We're not just classmates. We're friends. So sorry about going off on that uh, that rant yesterday. But uh, yeah, so I'm cool with her. Anyway, something weird happened. So, class ends, and I went. I went to go for like a split second to go talk to, um, you know, the classmate that I saw earlier in uh, early in the day before class started, right? So I started talking to her, and Amish girl just goes walking off, just storming off. And she gives me this look, and she goes, "So storming off? What the, what the hell is wrong with you? Like, what? I I can't talk to other people. I can't talk to other girls. Like, if you're jealous, then you know, tell me." Oh, like, I wonder, I really wonder, how does she feel about me? You know, she likes me, then, okay, but, you know, all I did, I did you know, all I did was only just talk to this classmate about the outside of it, you know? <laughs> so, yeah, she just goes storming off, I'm like, okay, I guess I'll just see her later, I guess. So, uh, start talking to another classmate, uh, apparently this classmate, she's already, uh, a preschool teacher and that she's just taking this that these college classes just for like backup so she can be like a middle school or high school teacher I'm like oh okay interesting so uh, we talked for a while uh, uh, then she has to right like right after class she has to go to the preschool so uh, we separate ways. I didn't get her name I didn't get her name I really don't feel like I really want to get her to know her name really but yeah didn't get her name uh, so, uh, I was like, after I was done talking to her, I was like, okay, well, where did Amish girl go? So, I, like, head over to where her class is. She wasn't there. I head over to where our usual spot is, where we chose. She wasn't there. Okay, I don't know I don't where she is. So, oh, well. So, I uh, walked into the B building, and then there was uh, a classmate that I know of uh, from my women's literature class. Uh, she's not a friend. She's just a person that I know of. Definitely, definitely just a classmate. So, um, she's sitting there stuffing, so I go there and I start talking to her. Uh, she's really not that cute. To tell you the truth, really not that cute. Uh, nah. <sighs> but, uh, I don't care. Well, I need I need to talk to girls anyway, so I go over and talk to her. I didn't say I was really flirting, but, you know, I was just talking. Uh, so, anyway know her a little bit better really I don't even know her name either because I don't know I just feel like I really shouldn't want to get to know anybody's name anyway someone is fucking typing me on Skype you guys won't hear it because of course I can delete it but it's either Holly Stanzi or Tiago and they blow up my Skype those three blow up my Skype ridiculous I'm trying to end this video anyway uh, we go into uh, literature class and in literature class we watch a particular movie that is pretty famous for memes for a particular me. So the movie that we are watching is The Wicker Man. And if you guys don't know what the movie is of uh, The Wicker Man, then of course it's the movie No Not the Bees My Eyes. Oh no, not the bees! Not the bees! Ah! Oh, not my eyes! My eyes! Ah! Ah! So, uh, we watched that for all class, and the teacher's like, why is our shoulders tired, blah, 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 you're gonna write an essay about this, I'm like, oh, okay, I get, anyway, class ends, um, go home, and that's pretty much it, like, just watch a new episode of South Park, watch a new episode of South Beach Toe, watch a new episode of, uh, Key and Peele, and that, that was my Wednesday, alright, so I'm going to go ahead and end this episode, so I hope that you guys enjoyed, so thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and I will see you guys tomorrow, um, I will be doing with Holly, of course, Fridays, and um, talking about my Thursday. So, thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and I will see you guys tomorrow with that.